I have uh, more AR-15 parts. Now you know the build's going for my Anderson lower. I got a bunch of stuff. I'm still waiting on that upper. I'm still waiting on the gas tube, uh, the gas block. So whenever it gets here, we're going to put it together. Or I'm going to attempt to if I can't get help from anybody else. I ordered two lower kits. That was a complete accident. Well, not an accident. I just got impatient. The first kit I ordered was from Rock River Arms. Now, they sent me a confirmation email. You know, kind of funny like after I already received the other one. Here's my Rock River Arms. We'll pull it out for you guys. You guys can see it. I'm sure you guys have gotten it before. Now, I ordered the, I'm going to say it wrong, the Timini, 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 whatever trigger. The whole kit that's it's supposed to be a drop in. Well, it got back ordered, so I kind of canceled the order. But this is your lower parts kit. It has everything you need in it. I got the grip, but I got it. Looks like without the trigger. I already have the safety. I'll be pulling this apart. I'm not sure what I'm going to use if I'm going to use this one or that one. But this is the Rock River Arms kit. I'm not going to open, you know, display all the parts on the table. You guys have seen it before. Standard grip. It's like the same one on my stack, but I'm going to go with the Magpul. I got to order it. I'm going to get it in the old D green, the Myad grip. So now here's the other kit. The other one comes with a sticker. It's the CMMG. And what's pretty cool about this kit, which I really, really liked, well, besides, you know, another grip. I mean, you know, I mean, get my, my grips going on. What's cool about this kit is the kit comes in all uh, organized packs. They're all color coordinated or color coded, I guess you want to say. You know, I'd show you guys, but I'm not going to open them up and lose, lose any of this shit. I'm going to try to get that fucking, that dude, what's his name, to come over and help me. What is his, what is his name? Oh, Tadpole, that's right, that, that douchebag. I'm going to try to get him to come over and help me, but he, he won't help me because he, he's busy every weekend. I'm going to have to come up with a, some, some other plan. I mean, I, you know, I'm going to lose it. Maybe it's a good thing I got two kits. Maybe in case I, you know, lose something, I can kind of match them up and I can replace it. Um, another cool sticker, a little fucked up on the corner. I'll put up on the wall to go with the rest of them. You know, I'll do that right now. But I got my lower parts kits. I'm going to attempt to put it together. I know I'm going to need some tools. So Tadpole will probably come over and help me if he can find time in his busy ass life. You know, if he's not, you know, gloating to fucking Pete about the Rangers being in the playoffs and how the Flyers and the Devils aren't in the playoffs and, you know, how we, we've been sucking it up this year. And don't make comments that if any of my stickers are crooked, I can't tell. All right, and I'm, I'm not getting down on the plane to fix it. But these are the two lowers, CMMG, Rock River Arms. Now, the new addition to the gun, or to the rifle, is my new barrel. Surprise, this came in. To show you guys, 556 by 18 SSP3. And I'm trying to look, I think it's BH, BHW. Came with all its protective caps. It's a 16 inch carbine. If I can get the cap off. It's like tight as hell on here. Must, oh, it's probably hot as hell in this room. This thing is just swollen up. But I got the cap off. You get the thread protector off. And it's that half inch by what well, was it guys? Like 28 or whatever. Thread pitch size. Here's the barrel. It's got its, I believe it said M4 feed ramps. I, I'm trying to remember when I ordered. You know, after you wait so long for stuff after you order, you kind of don't, uh, well, I don't remember anything. I know it's chrome lined, the whole nine, so it's going to be a nice addition to the rifle. I actually tested out the threads before. I threw my muzzle brake on there just to make sure it works. So there's the same one that we had on the Wyndham AR we did. So we're just going to keep building ARs, guys. I mean, you know, it's good videos, a lot of fun. I'm sure you guys like seeing different things being built. I wish the stuff was a lot easier to get because, I don't know, man, still waiting on that upper, the gas block, the gas tube. You know, I wanted that trigger, but that was back order, and I don't feel like paying inflated prices. But that's like me trying to get anything else, like, you know, false promises on other rifles that I would have cared what I paid as long as I got it, you know. 
I mean, I could have got it if I lived in another state, but this this New Jersey bullshit. It's got to stop. I mean, it's too bad we make good money for what we do here. That's the only thing keeping me here. But, as you guys can see, stop rambling. Get my protein out of the way. So, we got the Rock River Arms lower parts kit. And we got the CMMG lower parts kit. And we got a new barrel. So, those are my new additions. You guys will see. We'll put it together, maybe soon. You know, I'd, I'd hate to have it all here except the upper and all that other shit. So, alright guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys soon.